having pregnant as you put it. No, it wasn't that. <laughs> it was that momentary thing. It lasted probably about uh, <clears throat> a minute or more. And then I, hast I hastily moved away from the spot. The spot. And it took a little while from, from my head to feel back yeah. to normal. Because yeah. what happened, you know, is <clears throat> when I I was normal going into the place, but well, the moment I reached that spot, it just zoom, hit me. Whoa. Yeah, it's like whatever was there or whomever <clears throat> was there, maybe looking at items too. I don't know. But that moment in time, I just had the experience. It was awful. And the person had the same experience too. Mm -hmm. So... That for me, um, I do believe that there are people out there who are special because there are people who will tell you that they see. Yeah? Remember, the phone lines are open. Feel free to share. Another experience, well, I heard of the lady herself. She spoke to me and she said she went into a particular business place and there was a queue. <clears throat> and she saw, she can see them. And mm -hmm. she saw the object. I mm -hmm. can't say the person, the thing. Yeah. In the line. Someone said, Oh, you know, say, you know, is spirit. And she said, It wasn't on the ground. It was off the ground, like floating in the air. Mm -hmm. Yes. <clears throat> and I said, What was the clothes that the person, you know, had on? And she said, It was like a black. Like normal clothes, like normal people. And it was like black. Big, tall, strapped in fella. So me not go tell her, I say, I like she had there. <laughs> because if she says she go into the place, and the same head thing. Ed raised big. Yeah, Ed raised big thing. So, yeah, she had that experience as well. So it's not for me to say, oh, she can't. She didn't see anything, I like she had there. So if this person says she saw, then clearly I would want to think that she's a special person. She yeah. has some special form gift. of, you know, gift of seeing things that I would not want to see. Lisa, good night to you, Lisa. Good to have you, nevertheless. Novelet. Um, yes, we're working on that novelet in Canada. I think it's back. It's back. All right, we're back. Lady Juliet, North River Road, St. Thomas. Good night, clear on that road. Yeah. And the third one. Is where oh the third one go again me I'll forget to me to start get afraid. <laughs> um I'll tell you I, when I remember I'll tell you. But for you, haven't you ever had an experience where it just seems something that seems strange happened to you? Uh, Apart from almost catching the house of fire with the candles. <laughs> so I wasn't so um, No? Well, is it is not one which is of Paranormal. Mm -hmm. It's normal. It, all right. What really happened is that someone came to me, well, called me on the phone mm -hmm. and said to me that um, if you think may ever do you anything, forgive me. Ooh. I'm going to say, I understand him say, yeah, man, just forgive me if you think me ever do anything. Mm -hmm. And a lady was um, there at the time. And I called a lady and I said, yeah, Christian. She said, I'm a... She never said, she never said, use the word yes, but that's pretty much what... She, I guess, you know, you have the evangelist type of people, man. They, they, um, what they call the prayer warrior people. What, what, what kind of church them be? Whatever. Mm -hmm. I mean, I say to her, I say, boy, um, you know, you have some persons out there who they just want to be at peace with themselves. Oh. And smart enough, after do, do you nothing physically, you know, where you actually know that they have done you wrong, mm -hmm. and within themselves, they probably think that... You have uh, them up. Well, not, she, she never said that, but she said maybe because they have done something, they, the only way they can get it out of their system it's is right. actually face it and just seek forgiveness. Mm -hmm. Because for me, I was really taken aback because for me, I was like, 
yeah. All that thoughts. Good night, caller. Welcome to Real Talk. Hello. Pleasant, pleasant, pleasant. Good night. Good night to you, Bright. Yeah, walk on. Oh, I am here, you know. So we want. Have you been listening to the show? Repeat. Have you been listening to the show? Yeah, you know, they, me, 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 me just, uh, that, you know. All right, big up all the taxi drivers from your route right now, all right? So, big up all the taxi men on your route right now. Yeah, man, thank you for that. And you have to to all some truck men, you see? Yes. That when they break down in a, some dark area. Yes. I ask them to put some reflector on their vehicle. Oh. Which is true, right? And yeah, uh, I, 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 I run up into a park truck in a recommend a couple of minutes ago. Really? Yes, people bad me, hurt, injured, and was and take to the hospital. Oh my God. So uh, the driver did not start the truck. So the truck was in a dark, there was no reflector. Oh gosh. Yeah, so them have that style when they break down. Mm. Uh, no, no reflector at the back of the truck. Yes. So me appeal to the truck man there. Me name me in a motorist. You understand me? And the police officers were observing these trucks too. Huh? And the, the traffic police were on the road. Yeah. So examine the vehicles in the daytime too to see if they have on reflectors because they, they travel at nights too. Yeah. Oh yeah, my man. goodness, that's awful though. Yeah man, how that? Uh, Daddy Road. Daddy Road, what happened? Where's your brother? I went out with my family, um, Fan Fusion. Fan Fusion, Fan Fusion, yes. I went out with that, July. July? July. A July. Yeah, July 13. Yes, sir. Yeah, man. Um, yeah, I'm not going to be here. I'm going to be here in a port marathon, you know? Yes. I'm going to be here in a port marathon. I'm going to be here in a port marathon. I'm going to be here in a port marathon. I'm going to be here in a port marathon. I'm going to be here in a port marathon. I'm going to be here in a port marathon. I'm going to be here in a port marathon. I'm going to be here in a port marathon. Oh, where am I coming from? Yeah, man, I rock a besta, you know? I rock a besta crew locked in, all right, every time. Yeah, man, when they hear me from the radio, they, 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 they make me know, say, boy, I put them get on this at the same time, you know? Real talk. Yeah, man, so get some of those things, but you don't know what they're saying. You don't have to break now. So, so bright, yeah? Yeah. We're not going to break yet. I want to ask you something. You ever have an experience yet like that when we talked about earlier? Have you ever had an experience where you think that there are people out there who, are, who can see things and know things and come to you with anything where you say, boy, you want to say, oh, they know this? Yeah, how oh, know that? Yeah, how oh, them know? You wonder how oh, them know that about you and you never tell them anything? Like something strange. What is the strangest thing ever happened to you? Oh, they come to me and I mean, I wonder how oh, they know that? Yes. Okay, no, I know. So nothing strange never happened to you where I wonder, say, boy, I how that happened? Right, yeah? Hello? Yeah, we're asking you if anything strange ever happened to you when it comes to spiritual things. Anything no, strange no, ever happened to you yet? No, sir. What? You never pick up no dopey pan the road yet? Eh? You never pick up no dopey pan the road yet? Never seen nothing on the road yet? Pick up any dopey. Dopey? Eh. Yeah. When I hear you. No, when I have a dream, I'm a dream, I'm a dream to them. Oh, your dreams to them? Yeah, yeah, I know a dream to them. I'm a dream to them. I'm out of my eyes, you know? Oh, you're adding a bright enough, man. No, I'm not. Yeah, I'm a dream to them. Yeah, I'm a dream to them. You know what I mean? I'm going to start calling your dull eyes. Yeah? We're gonna start calling dull eyes, man. Yeah. <laughs> All right, sir. Thank you so much for calling. Yeah, and we pray that nobody is, you know, fit, nothing is fatal out of those accidents. Yeah, yeah, better myself. Yes. All right, Brad. Thank you. Yeah. 
Yeah, man, right. give thanks. Respect. Big and serious, we really pray that nobody loses their life yeah, in man, that a, one. A, a real thing in that, man. Is the a, is trucks, a... They have a responsibility, drivers. They have a trucks. Drivers and owners of the trucks, please. You're here. And if you know somebody who have a truck and have a reflector, please encourage them to put on some reflectors. Quite a bit of people lose their life that yeah. way still, you know? Quite a bit of people. And, and ironically, too, I see vehicles, you're going, going in the opposite direction, a vehicle is coming towards you. And you see one light, swear blind is a bike. True. When the thing reaches to hell, it's a big everlasting the unit. Unit. You know, because you only have one light. Come Definitely. on, people. Come on, come on. You have to, you have, you have to, if you're going to use the road, use it responsibly. Definitely. All right. So, so you know, it, it's just one of them things that where this kind of happened where me I wonder, say, boy, Jano, look at it. Eh? At least the individual kind of see it within, within himself. He said, boy, you know, forgive me, but me still taking it back as to. Why? Yeah. But, was he motivated to? Was, you know? Yeah. Did you get some intuition to come? It could be. It could be. It could be. It could be because sometimes people just want to make peace yeah. with themselves and with God. That's what that, 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 that's what the they, warrior they woman says. They think say, they're you know? going to die too. You find out people tend to yeah. want to, you know, make good. Yeah, because um, I heard of a story of a lady that she went over the other place. So pretty much she died. Uh -huh. Right? So... Her soul left her body. This is her um, story, you know. Yeah. And she saw Jesus, but she was actually hellbound. Mm -hmm. And she was like, "Yo, how is it that I've been doing so much, you know, good, and I'm I'm practically gonna go to hell?" Mm -hmm. And her story is that she was told. I don't remember exactly what had happened, but she was told by Jesus that you have not forgiven the person. Wow. Wow. And she was brought back to life with the intention to, to forgive the person. Right. Wow. So that was her ticket, mm -hmm. her opportunity to make good. Wow. So maybe, you know, that, that would have been her, I guess, strange encounter. Strange encounter. Mm -hmm. You know? I mean, when my little boy still you know, we used to go to my granny yard. <laughs> and we used to go down a little river there on a Janga Gully. Right? Uh -huh. And Kias, I tell you, choked. <laughs> me leaf up one, um, what you tree name? Breadfruit leaf. And I'm the biggest bullfrog that I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Yes, when my cousin then take over myself. <laughs> Yo, I was about one two months when I go back a river. Oh my god. We used to always go try to catch Janga and then sitting there. And crayfish. But when we see that the frog there, nobody. <laughs> <laughs> no. So right now that's strange to me, you know. That's strange to me. And I mean, there, there are so many things where people actually Go through. Oh yeah. Where I, I, we know they're gonna be sharing tonight because not no, that um in Canada. And by the way, we are back up for the peeps who are overseas. Yeah, good to have you on board. Welcome. I'll give you the vox pop in a minute. Novlet in Canada says, um, Cleo, my sister said that Doppy don't have no head. She can see them. Do they are they all headless? I, I wonder. Hmm. All right, so let's go to the Vox Pop for our friends who have just joined us via the World Wide Web. All right, Mysteries of Life. What's one of the strangest things that you have ever encountered? Marvin, what's strange ever happened to you, whether paranormal or otherwise, yeah? And do you believe that there are people of this world that have, gift, that have a gift and these people are special? How would you deal with a situation where someone mysteriously approaches you with information that no one else but you could have known? Yep. So it's a three-part question, and we are now on the 10.30 break. The time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services. And Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage and Lighting. Stick around. Soon come. 
Architects, draftsmen and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high quality white paper printing that is water resistant and never fades unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893-2266 For the best quality in sound reinforcement and backlining native audio we have professional engineers with over 20 years of experience so call us and we'll take care of your parties, wedding receptions barbecues, conferences and small stage shows Crystal clear sound, native audio. Our prices are the best. Call us at 871-5212. That's 871-5212. Native audio. We make your events audible. 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 Are you sick of living an average life and tired of just getting by? Do you want to take your life to the next level? Learn the secrets of the super successful. Listen to Power in a Half Hour with Coach Mark this and every Wednesday night on Styles FM from 9 to 10 p.m. Learn the habits of the super successful and how to make these habits work for you. Learn to turn your dreams and desires into reality. You can win in the game of life. Let Coach Mark show you how every Wednesday night on Styles FM from 9 to 10 p.m. Party people, are you ready? Stars 96 FM and DJ4, the illest, present Detour. This and every Saturday night, 8 p.m. to midnight. Tune in for the best mixes, the better mixing, and nothing but vibes. Ladies, 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 it wouldn't be a party without the ladies. Ladies special detour hour, 11 p.m. to 12 midnight. That's the Saturday night detour. Stars 96 FM with the illest DJ4. 8 p.m. to 12 12 midnight, you just gotta tune in. Do you have or are you seeking a place to rent? Seeking employment or have a job vacancy? Are you selling a car or having a garage sale? Then come see us. Let Styles do the advertising for you and you'll be on your way in no time. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Advertising Style. Advertise with Styles. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting and trust systems for your small and medium sized events, whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Adele Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Yep. Welcome back. And we do our vox pop tonight mysteries of life what's one of the strangest things that have ever happened or that you have ever encountered do you believe that there are people of this world that have a gift and they are special how would you deal with a situation where someone mysteriously approaches you with information that no one else but you could have known you know oh, okay. we have a caller. good night caller welcome to real talk yeah, clear. This is Marvin again. Hi, Marvin. So, um, yes, go right ahead. Responding, responding to, to what you're talking about. Um, I had a couple of strange things happen to me. Yes, um, share. Can you share? First, first, first of them was that um, I remember um, I was working at this one hotel, and um, everybody was, all my friends were going to Florida, and I wanted to go. So I was, I was like, man, what can, what? Good as this can I come up with to tell these people so they'll give me the townhouse. Yeah. And I said to them, Oh, my girlfriend is passed and I gotta go down with that mm-hmm. and I kid you not, the next day I got a call that my grandma died. I kid you not. Yeah. And the second thing that happened, um, like I had a like I've been having like a couple of days, right? And the first one does that you know what I mean? Me and my cousin was outside playing marble, but we were young, like, we were young, 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 young. And all of a sudden, the whole sky just turned, just turned black, pitch black. And 
the, 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 the moon, the sun turned into a clock, and it started saying 12 o'clock. Mm-hmm. And it's like I could hear a voice saying, time is running out. And it just clear up, and everything went back to normal. Yeah. And it's like ever so often, I will have a dream that, every time I have the dream is that God was coming, and I wasn't ready, and I always trying to rush and get ready, rush and get ready. Mm-hmm. And the last, the last one I had was that he actually came. I was on earth, and I still wasn't ready. Mm-hmm. And I was running around, running around, running around. And I remember running to a building, and a lady said, can I help you? And I was like, yeah, I'm looking for a place to repent, because God is here, and I'm still not ready. Mm-hmm. And she was like, oh, go down. There's a building down the street. Go down to that building, and you can use that building. And she on time my phone ring, I woke me up out of the sleep. Yeah? <laughs> wow. So, Marvin... Yeah. You ready? <laughs> 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 I'm not going to see him today because I know I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> Respect, Marvin. All right. Thank you. All right. All right. Um, you know, funny how Marvin said that. Mm-hmm. Someone said to me that, you know, there are people out there. She said, look, I'm a Christian. Mm-hmm. And just before my sister died, she called me and said that she is sorry mm-hmm. because she did she did avar up. Wow. Right? And but she never she have her up on the inside. So she wants Charlie to know say so boy she's sorry. Mm-hmm. But she went on further during the conversation and said to me, Mr. Boy, you know, you have people out there who are not saved. Mm-hmm. But the Bible talk about them because they are so pure in their heart that they are also recognized. Mm-hmm. You know, Mr. Boy, them people they pretty much don't really have nothing against people them you know it, it's like them just mellow so you have to understand say boy like how she know to me when i say she have a gift because mm-hmm. hey you have some people you know oh boy boy me, mm. pe, me tell you, people me like you know, but me tell you truth, me afraid of you know. and anybody this link just do take it <laughs> they were coming around building and right away, then get a vibes and just start praying mm-hmm. and catching a spirit. And you, whether they feel poor, you could say, I say, boy, how on to them? <laughs> Believe you, me, them, the people, they say something we don't say, and them, I feel some, something we don't mm-hmm. feel. Mm-hmm. I'm afraid of them. I'm mm-hmm. not lying. You know. I'm glad no one never used to come to the yard when I'm there, I'm going to Because. Said- I have this friend who we went to a, a social gathering some months ago and she says she can actually feel people's energy. Mm. Good energy. She feels it and she knows it. Yeah. And if the energy is not good and it's bad, she can feel the person and she would stay away from that person. From that person. Who is, and I, I kind of wanted to know what she felt, you know, how she knew that this person, she said the energy that they push off you sense the evil, Mm-mm. the maliciousness, the envy, the grudgefulness, the bad mind thing about them. You Whoa. can sense that. I was like, seriously, so me you know just <coughs> if you ask her, so my girl, my energy good? <laughs> <laughs> Mark you, I knew it was yeah. from my advantage point then. Because I mean, I have the time to think the way some people might think negatively. True. You know, it, it saps my energy. So I'm always this bubbly, lively person who, if me, me down and depressed or look away because I'm either sick or I go through a rough time or something, but naturally on any given day, I'm a free-spirited, a bubbly, spunky. Yeah, spunky kind of person who have pureness of heart and mind. Yeah. So I hasten to say to her, my girl, walk on with me. She said, you're a good man. She said, to laugh. You know, <laughs> declare you're a good man. I said, all right, thank you, Lord, for that. You know, so there are people who have certain gifts of with a permission or yeah, and I remember. Tell you. I remember this young lady said to me one time, "Say boy, 
she called me HJ. Mm -hmm. So HJ, I saw your aura. Mm -hmm. I said, my aura? Mm -hmm. Aura? Yeah. She said, me just see like one... Halo? A halo. Uh-huh. I said, halo. Uh, we're actually at a training in Kingston. Mm -hmm. She said, yeah. That's something where I can see. Wow. I said, but I don't understand because how she'd say it was that say, there was somebody who passed mm -hmm. and like she was looking and she could have, she, she see it. Wow. You know? And she had said, boy, as something where she have seen more than once. Mm -hmm. I'm like, wow, Jano, people out there where can just, mm -hmm. you know, me, 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 me want if I have no gift. Because if I have a gift, that means I me give. Don't I give me a gift. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I broke. <laughs> I don't know really. How, 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 how them, them live with that? Pe people will say them can't see spirit. Mm -hmm. Right? People, people can't, will say, boy, them can't read you up. And right? when they do, the things that they're telling you is not far from the truth at all. It's like the truth. Why? I don't want nobody to read me because I'm sitting... I don't want to read it. I don't want to read it. So I'm kuro kuro waiting on me. I don't want to come out. I will wait a little bit. I don't want to come out. You're kuro kuro the least. There, there is somebody, on, even people on radio stations. Mm. You call in. I've heard programs like those. Yeah. But you call in and people tell you yeah, Things that yeah. are happening in your life and you're wondering, oh, on God's green earth, this man know this. You, you know, you, I've never done it, but I've heard persons who do it. You know, the lady, when you am Lady Cleo, remember back in the days? Call Cleo, man. No, Call Cleo. correction. Correction, she never named Lady Cleo. She didn't name Miss Cleo. There's a big difference. <laughs> no, man. No, don't do it, man. Don't do it. <laughs> Yo, I mean, don't make your food, you know. <laughs> don't do it, my young. <laughs> That was Miss Cleo call me now for your free reading because she me, back call, then. Call me Not, don't call me for that. I can't read a soul. I am Lady Cleo. She was Miss Cleo. It's a different thing. Don't mix us up. Miss Cleo, call <laughs> me now. I wear number again. But you, you, you can be the resurrected. No, my youth. No, no, no. You're not an ambition. What is that? You're not an ambition. <laughs> <laughs> you know me a party for a long time. I'm thinking of what? Out. <laughs> 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 I have no ambitions to be a fake. I'm sorry. <laughs> who said? Who talk about that? We are talk about over me, over eat a food. No, my youth, no scam. Nobody, my. Youth. Who never talk about in in Wallan? Scamming thing. Wallan, if somebody call you now, right? For free reading. And say Miss Cleo for free reading, right? <laughs> and you say, boy, you know, say you know, say your mama not like you. Right. I'm a caller. Wait, you want no more. Caller on the 453. Good night, caller. Good night, caller. How are you? I am not bad. Can you read me up? If I could, I could. All right. <laughs> Daniel talking to you, not clear. Who? Daniel. Oh, hi. <laughs> How are you? I'm all right so far. Good to hear you. Yes, I know. Oh, my you know, goodness. I'm listening to the program. I you know say it's really fast, too, because I remember one time ago when my daughter is so small. Mm-hmm. And um, I follow somebody go somewhere. And um, I went over her grandmother with her. And I was sitting down in the hall with her. And this lady come on and... She starts playing at the house and she starts playing. Mm -hmm. I believe they just look at me and look at me and tell me, said, look, anywhere you go with your daughter, don't go back there. Mm -mm. Yes, anywhere you go with your daughter, don't go back there because mm -hmm. she's not eating well. Oh. And demons been eating with her. Oh my gosh. She rice and I must stop give her rice, rice to eat. Oh my goodness. Yes. And I stop give her rice, rice just immediately. Mm -hmm. Every time I give her rice, I have to cook, cook it with like rice and cheese and something. Mm -hmm. I don't even play my dad. Wow. Until now, my daughter is 17. Mm -hmm. Yes. So that if the people have gifts like that, 
Cleo. I'm so, telling you. So, let me ask you yeah. a question. So, should I eat white rice all now? Until now, I don't give it to her. So, where do you eat with curry goat? Rice and peas. Rice and peas. I don't bring a banana. So, where do you eat with curry chicken? Rice and peas. Dumpling and banana. Dumpling and yeah, me give her dumpling and banana. I am. I don't give her. I don't give her white rice. So where do you eat bully beef? She no eat bully beef. She no eat bully beef. Ah whoa! That's right, Dania. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! So you believe that your parents thought they were special? And I you know that you know that when I when I be pregnant with her. When I expected her, um, I remember me going to church. Mm-hmm. I okay. want a little prayer because I first child to me, I don't want a... No Good pregnancy. A yes. Yeah. And delivery. I don't want a, yeah, a free delivery and everything. Yes. And the pastor said, come here. Everybody gone out of the church now, and the pastor looked at me and said, you... Pregnant lady, come here. Mm hmm. Me, I said, Jesus, please, no. I said, Me, I said to myself, you know, I said, Oh my God, what women do know? Mm hmm. I start stretching up here. And the man said to me, said, Don't be afraid of me. I start to tremble. <laughs> and the man started dealing with all certain things, you know? Mm hmm. To me, you know, and I said, Oh, this man know me life. Mm hmm. With the oh, this man know. I mean, I said, no, sir, me, me not, me, all I tell me, sir, said, me not believe. Oh, gosh. I mean, man, look at me, I said, if me want me try to live, me have to, me have to stop, stop doing me have to do. Mm-hmm. The Father Jesus, me, a woman. Nervous, I know, eh? Yes, me start fret. Me no know what to do, me no know nothing. All the man says, Stop the way you have to do. Anything what? way, anywhere you're going with your belly, don't go anymore. Because I usually like go party and then something. Mm-hmm. And the man tell me, say, do not go there because I'm going, the baby's going to die. Yeah. Wow. If you save the baby, if you save the baby life, they must just stay put. Yes. Well, I'm glad you listened. Yes, because when the man looked at me and told me that, I was so shocking. Mm-hmm. Wow. So well, people, have a lot of, people have a lot of gifts, and when, you, when they have their spiritual gifts, and somebody comes to you and tell you, don't be afraid. Just listen. Real because talk. They, they, because the creator himself gives that person gifts to one people on this earth. Yes. And it is real. And real, I believe in it. Real talk. Thank you so yeah, much, darling. I, yes. All right. Take care, Dania. Yes. Okay, then. Bye. Good to hear from you. Be All up. right. <laughs> okay, then. Clear. <laughs> A very, very interesting story right there. I tell you. Uh, Marcia in South Carolina says, um, listening. Well, not Marcia. Is it Marcia? Good night to us, she said, rather. 240, listening from Maryland. I do believe that there are those special people around. They're, they're used to being, they're used to be seeing a lot of church, churches back in the days that could see things and draw up people. But that's fade out a lot. So there are people who used to have those churches who they could see stuff. And there are a few churches, churches still in Jamaica, for example, that can still see things. True. And I know of one particular one where the gentleman said he went to this church for prayer. And as he could go up to the altar for prayer, they were able to tell him that he was there for a stomach problem. Yeah. And that pretty much... Acid reflux situation was his was his problem, Mm-mm. and he said he had not told anybody at that church that situation, and that was really what was really bothering him for you. Wow! So is either these persons are seeing, or something, or they're feel I don't know they're feeling some form of energy, some spiritual thing going on for them. 
to 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 be able to do that um you have some um videos with pastors yes churches that people actually do spiritual, spiritual healings stuff, and right. stuff and you, you're like huh how come and, and sometimes you tend to want to want to think one of it's staged i wonder if it's actually real yeah. you know so there, there, there's this one with, with an african pastor me say boy him, him at the bus right now mm -hmm. i remember his name him just go into the crowd and say yo where you come here for mm -hmm. you know believe in this where you come here for wow you know, and, and like I say, I'm a, I'm a pastor, so I say, say, yes, but where you really come here for? Mm -hmm. You're not a believer. Wow. And so right where the person start confess, a, a next pastor confess and say, boy, he really come for witness mm -hmm. because he don't believe that so he is that powerful. Oh. And I pick him, pick out the man out of the crowd. Wow. Wow. Why? At random, eh? At random. Wow. Yeah. Caller on the 453 once more. Good night, caller. Good night, Lena, clear on the road. Hey, how you doing? Well, go on, Senti. No, not too bad. Cool, not cool. The program, but you know, the spiritual people will be there for you. Eh? You have an experience? Tell us about it. Yeah, I have an experience. Then it was about eight years old. Yeah. School. My grandmother is out. Me used to stay and my grandmother. Mm-hmm. But when night comes, my grandmother. Right. So anyway, cut it short. One man, I get up. I go feed my grandmother for all them. I feel like something sticking on my foot. And I start crying and my mother said, what do you? I said, mama, something sticking on my foot. I shall look on my foot and nothing will be there. And I take a piece of sickness, a piece of sickness take me one year almost. Mm. And my mother was coming to work with the plane. There's a plane, you know where you are, Lord? Yeah, I said, I sent a watch. Which part? Yeah, which part? York, 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 him say. Yeah, York. Yeah, see, when it comes to my mind, baby, and you read that first. Yes. And my mother was coming from her the evening, and uh, walking to York, going up to see for it, and I didn't get to out. I said, I'm sick, but you know, now I got out of school, now I eat nothing, but mm. that. I said, the lady come out, and I spin on the road three times, and saw my mother, and said, look at your picture, you that daddy. You know, sister, they're the back, they're back in the fit me. Mm. He said, the man, when he come out and said something joking, nine foot back on, you couldn't see it. And my mother said, she don't know how the woman come up. Just come out there, in that, but she have a church. A revival church. Yes. And you know, I said, no matter, tell my mother, say, bring me, come a man, don't go and work. Mm-hmm. And I go, and the woman, Go on with something, dumb something, I believe spirit them. <laughs> yes. And we start, she tell my mother to leave me with her, but my mother said, no, you know, leave me out. Mm-hmm. She will make me come, I'll be at whenever time. She want me to come. And right now, I tell her, she may have. Yes. This is the evil, evil is there. And spiritual people, there, and people is there to take care, to look about you. Yes. Right, because my mother said, she don't know the woman none at all. Yeah. Right, because she had not, it's a whole lady, but she not come on street then. Yeah. My mother would have known her. So she said, when the woman come out and tell her that, and I'll be to see for she had children. But most. And she go tell somebody, and the person yes, she ain't gone. Every time he in the house, you see a big green is that go up in the house. And nobody now sees Lisa that way from me. Wow. So, may I tell you right now, the experience is near 66 now. Wow. I'm still going strong. Wow. No, A success yes, story yes, there. Not, uh, eh? Success story, huh? Yeah, man. I listen to every night. Anyway, me anyway, there at night time, you know, at the year 9 o'clock, when we reach home, you know. Mm-hmm. Uh, sometimes when I hear me call, me just there and listen. Yeah, man. But the, the man in C14, you know that. Yes. Because you say you have some, you have, you have some Thomas, I mean, I'm related to some Thomas stuff. Yes. Yeah. So, me know how them things them thing they're there. And me, me have the, the experience of it. So, when people are talking about even now there, it's there. And good exist too. Good. That's where we have a lot of good because good over evil. Yes, definitely. Every time. Every time. Yeah, but, but, 
Do you believe that there are people of this world that have a gift and are special? Mm. I wish I had the gift of discernment mm. to be able to foresee things. Yeah, I wish I had that gift. Yeah, but all right, I'll show you something. You know the saying when them when them say trouble not set like I rain. Agree. Set, you know say nothing no go so do. Caller on the four five three. Good night. Good night, Claire and Daddy Road. Hi, how Oi. you doing? What's up, Putos? Not a thing. Yes, I'm telling you that there are people that God gave that gift. Yes. If you read the Bible, you have gift of healing, gift of discerning. Give from prophecy, yes. the time that prophesying is telling you about what happened in your life. After last night, I went to a crusade, mm. and the pastor man was there. And when time came, he called and said, there is someone in body in the crowd here who is suffering with the issue of blood. Come, come, don't be afraid, come up here. Someone went up there to, I troubled my sight so I couldn't see the person. But I heard him ask the person, yes. how long have you been suffering with his blood? So talking to Mike, the, the lady said, four years. Four years? And the pastor man called her up. He called again. He said, someone in here is struggling with a lump right here. Right wow. Here. Come along, come along. Come, 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 come for your healing. And everyone that he called up with an with a issue, mm-hmm. they were true. People went up for it. Wow. He did use just use the olive oil to anoint them, for it, touch them, for it, and receive the healing. Wow. And he, t- and he told the lady, by tomorrow morning, you won't see that blood again, for you have been healed. Wow. Mm-hmm. So there are people with those gifts. You have people like they have in a crusade, or even a church, and your, pro- your pastor is a discerner. Sometimes the name of the person come up to them. They will say, who oh, in here name Sharon? Is there a Sharon in here? Mm-hmm. And they will look, somebody get up, who oh, name Sharon and go up. Yeah. And then they just begin to tell them what's taking place in their life. Wow. Yes. So there are people who read the Bible tell you about the different gifts. Yes, definitely. Yes, there are gifts. Some people, you, you pray, you have God say, God, if you're a Christian, I'd like to have the spirit, the gift of discerning. Yes. When you're in the church, you discern things. You go among people, evil, you discern it. You understand? True, All true, right, my true, darling. true, true. Thank true. you so much. Right. Take care. Yeah, man, All you right. too, darling. Thanks for sharing. Yeah. Uh, you, you can imagine all me now. And crew say that go on a, a, a mile of walk past, a drive past. Oh, it's a... Oh, yo. <laughs> come take care, come here. Come here. Yeah. How you, you start too. with your pants. Yo, why make you chat so much? Why make you so lie? <laughs> Wait, some says, last week one day I went to the hospital to visit some church sisters. And the vibes wasn't right. I have to hold my peace. Mm. Wow, Mama that means, a, that, means mm. that you feel one energy. Yeah, one energy. One energy. Not good it? at all. Um, Kevin in Tampa, Florida says, Yes, you can tell if the person is good or evil by looking at them. Easily it can tell. tell. Wow. Some people give some, some, some vibes. Some vibes, boy. You yeah. Just, you, you just yeah. know, say, boy, yo, I don't want to dare on that money that the energy does not right. It just, it, it just terrible. You, you know, you have some people out there, every time them call you, I just bad news. Mm-hmm. They never call you with nothing positive yet. 
it's like them grow and I search for things, I search mm -hmm. for things. Wow. It's right now, I search for 11 o'clock. The time is brought to us by <laughs> VJ Printing Services. Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage, Stage and Lighted. Light. We're so forward. For the best quality in sound reinforcement and backlining, Native Audio. We have professional engineers with over 20 years of experience. So call us and we'll take care of your parties, wedding receptions, barbecues, conferences and small stage shows. Crystal clear sound, Native Audio. Our prices are the best. Call us at 871-5212. That's 871-5212. Native Audio. We make your events audible. 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 Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 8 Eight nine three two two six six. Guess what? Styles FM has a new business number for you to call, text, and now WhatsApp five one eight two three nine nine to advertise your business and events. Call, text, or WhatsApp us on five one eight two three nine nine five one eight. Don't forget 518-2399 Remember Styles FM on social media View us on YouTube at Styles FM Radio Follow us on Instagram at Styles FM Like us on Twitter at Styles FM 961 Become a fan on Facebook Styles FM 96.1 Clifford Guest House Sponsor of Metamorphosis on Monday nights from 9 p.m. to 12 midnight with Dr. Iman Black. Located at 15 Queen Street, Port Antonio, that's Ditchfield Hill, they offer accommodations for up to one month. Call them at 285-0610 for more information. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Yep. Welcome back to the final hour or so of yeah. Real Talk. You, you know, you, you know one I think now? Me feel some have to give her sadness. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right off of the hill without break. Could well, I crash and end up somewhere? Well, no, that means I'm in a salt. Oh. But you know, people, talk it you. Some something ever reach you know, yet, and then you know, really look upon it, upon it and say, boy, no. That's not normal. Mm -hmm. I tell you what reach my wadi. Right? My car their garage. Months now. About three months now, I carry their garage. Mm -hmm. Right? Become so boom. Simple thing in a rock and pinion. Right? Mm -hmm. order the, we can't get it locally, so I come so boom, boom, and I order the rock and pinion. Go online, see the rock and pinion, look on the part number, I order it. Right? Canada. Reach Jamaica, feel good. Mechanics mm -hmm. said, no, the wrong one you get. Ouch. <laughs> I link with the people him, and they said, boy, I want the on the picture. I said, no, I said, no, but what the on the picture and the part number where you advertise, a part number people buy parts by. Mm -hmm. They said, all right, here what? Keep it, we'll give you back some of your money. I said, fine. I order it now from Australia. Weeks, weeks pass, and bam, finally reached. They said, yeah, man, everything good. The man said, then start the car now, you know. And you know, there's something where you you know, you know, oil filter, you don't have oil filter. Mm -hmm. Now, I never hear this in all of my life. All the mechanics say, boy, he has never experienced this in all of his life. The man said, when they start the car, the car they attract a car, they look to see if any water a leak or anything. So, they say, boy, they just see the, 
you can know, there's something where the aisle pants, where, where the aisle filter screw on pants jump out. Ouch! <laughs> 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 no, that's a oh, give us salt. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Man said never in a film years. They never said that yet. Wow. So right now, me just know, say, right now me just know, say, anybody who wants some salt, yeah, me have it. Right? More than the sea. Yeah, me have it for go, no. If you know too, if things are going for too much, I don't want to tone down a little bit, call link me. <laughs> she, she don't want the clear work. <laughs> you don't want me to miss clear work. No, me don't want to miss clear work. Me I take work. on the next work. Lady clear. If you don't have nobody, if you don't, if you don't have bad ways about, you know, I don't want to sell this real smarty, you don't link me. Oh, Jesus. Right? No come here without nothing doing you know, up because if you don't come here without nothing, <laughs> you don't know what to is up. Criminal. You know. Criminal. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 but, no, no. We don't need your help. You can't stay. <laughs> you can't go sit on one side. But, you know, um, you have persons who actually... All right. I'm going to make a very controversial statement. This thing where people have said, boy, the devil's strong. <laughs> Why everything people say, boy, are the devil? Because nothing that's good ever comes from that. Yeah, but how, how, how we equate, as we say, trouble, me say trouble set like rain. Me say that. Because if, a simple thing, if you know some boy, you're a fast driver, mm. or quote unquote, you're living at the fast lane, the percentage chance or the probability of you getting in it's trouble higher. is very high. Mm -hmm. So if you just kick back, and well easy, the chance are going to decrease. Decrease, right? So me always a trouble set like rain. And you must be seeing it before it even gets into, get to that point. Because certain things you just know yes. that it's inevitable. Right. The outcome is it's inevitable. Ever, right. So if you know some boy you walk, and you hold up your head, and you look straight in front of you, you know, can't step in or something. Mm, bucket two and drop. And bucket two and drop. What does that have to do with the devil? <laughs> what does that have to do with the devil? Your neighbor dog drop sitting and your tepid eye. What does have to do with the devil? <laughs> you need a look. Is it the devil <laughs> making a look? <coughs> so me always take issues with a statement there. Right? Me agree, say yes. Jesus and good things are work for you. I may agree, say yes, bad things will happen. Some things are just natural. Mm. So, me can't go equate everything. One time, I met my wife at talk and she said, Boy, the devil trang. I said, Karen, seriously? You think so, you have little time for waste for me and you're right here, so when they sit and just drop a while, gone broke. Uh -huh. One to the masculine, we're going out there, so what Then, who do that? You uh -huh. have time to do that at the same time? If he's so powerful? Oh, wow. Lord have mercy, I want to answer that must break up a while ago. Uh-huh. Right? But we have to give credence to real possibilities. Right? Because sometimes some things are just natural. You can think of um, the possibility of in a crowd of people who named Smith. Smith are the most popular last name. There is a Gonzalez and all them something mm. there, right? So the, 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 the likelihood of somebody having that name, you know, is great. Yeah. You have one video where I circulate, where one man have people all on them dirt. Mm, I think I saw a piece that? of it. I didn't, it yeah. Just, yeah. I had the it. best marketing video I've ever seen of in my life. Because the man I show you, the man say, eh, hey, I'm a piece of this, mm. right? And you have a rasa man, I be the people them. And I sap them down. Right? Mm. And I say, this, the man actually spent like 15 minutes. Wow. I promote himself and say, him are the best man in the business. Oh, you know, say that thing there mm -hmm. is, a, is a gift that the man have. Mm -hmm. But in promoting thing, and, well, I don't know if you think shut you now. <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> it circulates. Right? Oh, uh, the last part of the Vox Pop now 
Last part of the box. Oh, okay, box. let's go yeah. back to this. Um, Cassidy? Yes. <laughs> All right. Um, how would you deal with a situation where someone mysteriously approaches you with information that no one else Nobody but else. you could have known? I, I would really want to hear the final analysis of this of what the person has to say based on the scenario. Mm -hmm. What would be the outcome if I should continue along the path I'm on? I'd want really want to know. You're not curious, so that yeah, man. you're not going for the said part. I, I, no, I'd want to know from the person. Do you, what based on what you know, yeah? Mm -hmm. And this and based on the situation that I'm in, should I continue along that path or should I let go certain things and drop certain things? Just general idea of how I'm supposed to proceed based on what the person sees and knows. Because chances are they can see, foresee, if it is that it's going to be to my own detriment later on. Yeah. So, you know, or if it's going to lead to my detriment. Just give me enough idea as to um, what your take on the incident, so to speak. Because I think that would help. Should help. Yeah. Why? <laughs> but to abandon, you know, so look here, the man, go away, I go, yeah, I'm gonna believe that and whatever. I don't think it, I, would, it, I it, could do it, that. I think it for me, it, it would be a life changer, right? Okay, but I'm gonna start wonder if we actually tell somebody, yeah, and then it's that's not gonna be readily, it's not gonna be something you readily believe, believe, yeah, right. That's it. How would we tell? You know, so we tell, you know, so we tell, we tell, we tell, we tell that this man, yeah, this man, they tell that this man, they Right, because you know, just like what the lady said, the, the person approached her and said, Boy, look, you know, when there's something joke you saw the nine foot, you know, with, um, with, with Saint Thomas, say. mm -hmm. right? And I have heard of persons being in even a public place and somebody just walk up to them mm -hmm. and say, Boy, look, change your life, yep, because so and so and so, right? Or you know, say. Somebody or so and so at your workplace mm -hmm. after you. But I go I, I go I, I go and tell you this though. Some of these things, you know, are things that people can just plant in your head, you know. <laughs> True. Plant in your head and play for your psyche. Right? Because guess what? If they come and say, boy, hmm, look here. You have somebody at your place. Be careful. My name is Waste Maddy name. <laughs> True. I will tell you that. Oh, you know that. You know? Yes. Where is Waste is Maddy name? More and more. Oh, no, just be careful. It, it, it is broad. Right? It broad and it it, 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 little bit too general for you to say, all right, yeah, there is something in yeah, that statement. Right. Because it's a play for your psyche. And why? I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't absorb certain things. Some things, yes, but certain things, a little bit too. And, and I tell you something too. That is how scammers work. Mm. You know? Make you believe. Very plausible. Very, make you believe in a day that, that these things are actually happening. And by the time, by the time you check it out, your money done. <laughs> <laughs> your money done. We have a Vox Pop. We have a Vox Pop. Let's see what the people are saying on the streets. Hello, Rudy. Big up on yourself. Lady Clear. All our styles. Real talk. And tell us, say, my grandmother, my grandmother have that little, had that little power, you know. You see it? And... Tell a boy, tell a boy, tell a boy. Ooh, I forgot to touch back on this boy. Can I tell you, no, me, some little memories that come across, you know? Some little memories that come across. My grandmother used to can just tell people, say, oh, don't let a yard today or this and where, where, and, you know? Yeah, man, it's, it's like too much right now for even mention one particular. So look more into the show. I say we can make a one call. Yes, I do believe in it. I have people in churches like that. You see people walk on the street, yes, come up to you and say stuff to you, yes. But 
for some people it's superstition but it is real i've seen it happen many times to people even in churches on the street and different different places so it is it is reality that people can come up to you and say stuff to you that's really happening in your life real talk and i feel no way about it because you know we see it people tell me and it happened so i'm not gonna feel no way about that because me know real stuff me see happen to many people. If me go to church and me see it, so me know see a real thing. But me, some people believe different and think different, but to me, I know it's real because I see it happen. Even to myself, me go to church and the pastor come up to me and approach me, asking me question, tell me my name. Me never met him for Adam, so me know see a real thing, real talk. Oh boy. <laughs> so many people are saying though that they do believe, so... Um, believe, believe kills and it believe cures, it I says, cure. but I tend to want to believe. I, I do. I, um, had a problem. My personal experience, I had a problem with my feet at mm. one point where they would just hurt like crazy. Yeah. The ankles down would mm. just hurt. And I hold that thought. We have a call on the four, five, three. Good night, caller. Good night, Cleo. How are you? Hi, this is Navlet calling from Victoria. Oh, good to hear you. You sound so perky. That's good. Yeah, because um, I was like, couldn't hear you for, and then I text, and then I hear you come on. The, it's yes, we got that sorted yeah, out, thank God. Yes. I want to tell you, it's about spiritual person in church who you say can see things. Yes. And I, I'm going to call me and tell you, I used to live in Jamaica, Mountain View, yes. Backbush, Backbush, details. Mm -hmm. And there was this man named Mr. Vassal, we call him Duke. Yes. When you hear him come out, remember something going to happen. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> and it's it, so honestly... Something went happen. One Friday morning, he come out and he was like, "Bobo, Bobo, gunshot!" You know, that which is all about gunshot. Mm -hmm. And this guy named Krabby, we right at, out at the end of the gate, and we come out because once Juka won, everybody come out. Right. Wow. And he look at Krabby and he said, "What a pretty boy you are!" There was this big stone right at my gate, a very big bulldozer. And he said, look at the stone by my surrogate. Look, look at the stone. Look at the flowers. And he's there preaching and he's telling him. And, but we always say, he can see, but he can cut. That's mm -hmm. how Jamaican talk. He can see, he can cut. Uh -huh. And by within 12, 30, quarter to one, crabby were laid flat. What? Yep. Oh, my God. Ooh, I got a chills just now, girl. That was about 8.30, 9 o'clock when he was out there in the morning preaching. Yes. And in back between 12.30, quarter to one, he lay flat. He was killed by his own other friend, them, whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. And next incident again in 1980 when we couldn't get water. Jippy, this guy named Jippy, was coming up the lane, and he was coming down and he's calling out names and something like that happened. And he come and he stopped right before me. And as he touched Jippy, Jippy pulled back. He said to Jippy, me can't touch you. Jippy said, yeah, man, you can't touch me, touch me. And he touched Jippy two foot. And the next day, Jippy two foot broke off and missed that train water truck. Jesus have mercy, Lord Lady. <laughs> no, sir. <laughs> no. I oh, tell goodness. You, I tell you this one. When <laughs> my daughter told me this, <laughs> when I was in the States, I couldn't go home. I run out from a visa. Yes. <clears throat> It's because this lady named Sister Little, she goes to Mount Zion Church on Mount Zion. She come out and Duke was coming down and warning people. Mm -hmm. And she said she get a dream last night and Sister Little thought the dream. She said somebody and it's the person was in all white like an angel and the ill. Yeah. And 
Duke was one in Annie Duke. After he finished listening to what she said, she dreamed. He turned to Sister Licky Grandson and said, Hug your grandmother for the last time. Oh, Jesus. And Cleo, she never wake up to her mind to sleep away in her dream. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, sir. I tell you, when it happened, the day before, my daughter said, she don't believe it. She obviously thinks the pool. Mm -hmm. And when Sister Little sleep away, he came down and he called her and he said, you poop things now? He gave her a stone. My daughter told me, the Jew gave her a stone. And I said, you should have carried that stone everywhere you go with you. Mm -hmm. She said, she don't know what she do with the stone. Yeah, he, he passed away last year. Oh, my. Yeah, he passed away early last year. But what, when you hear him come out and open his mouth, yes. your body gets cool and everything because it's it now got two days and three days. Yes. It's like you drink your soup hot. Wow. So, the, and the thing is not like charging the money or whatever. It's just a little man living just a little... My little book, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yes. Always have it, always have the Bible. Mm. Always have the Bible. So some of these things too, but for them the one tell us they come and bring the phone mm -hmm. and twenty five thousand dollars, fifty thousand dollars. Nobody go clear, no go. Yeah, no, me, me, no, me love me run gone, <laughs> run gone somewhere else, opposite direction, not going there. <laughs> No go and then clear no go, but if you hear somebody and you stand up as you say, you talk about, you feel the connection and something all right. Yes, you can feel it. Even you can walk into the studio tomorrow morning and some connection not right in you. You can feel it. Mm. Sometimes you, you, you kind of get angry with yourself or angry just, you know, you miss every two days, but it's just the connection and you don't even know. It's true. Yeah, it's just, it, you don't even know. It's just the vibe. You don't even know. Yeah. Well, tell your co-worker, I said, Nina one, nothing falls to buy, so Nina come at me. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, darling. Thanks so much for coming. <laughs> okay, okay, I keep listening. Bye. You too, baby. <laughs> then, for, you see? Yes, she said something wrong with you. She has see? She has see? Kevin, <laughs> I get dream time yeah, of the time. Put a business, you know. <laughs> and it play full, it play right out in my eyes. Tell us about the dream, of Kevin, man. Kevin, don't leave with iron dry, so man. Come on, man. We want to <coughs> know about it. <laughs> Blessed Friday night to Cleo and Daddy Road. I fan members of Stars. Sonic big up, big up, big up, big up, big up, big up, big up. Okay. So, want to hear what Kevin have to okay. say. Okay. Yeah, your friend of my try to put me out of business. Hmm. Right. <laughs> but now I'm gonna put me out of business. It, <laughs> it just starts. <laughs> oh my goodness, those those experiences were. Where my name Joke? Joke, yeah. Mm. Yeah, cause I was gonna ask where is he now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. I was gonna ask the same thing too, but she said he passed. The part when the man touched man, touch man old age. Touched man pan in two foot. Lord have mercy. Mm mm mm. Well, you have, wow. you, have, you, have, you have mother, woman, and preacher this and preacher that and prayer warrior and them people still. You know. But, you know, the first one we talk about belief, kill, belief, cure. Right? And some of these things, if you even go up on YouTube and you type in paranormal, you see some, something where you have to wonder if I really, what you're watching, I think, are somebody actually create that graphics feel. You know, things where people are traveling time. Time machine. Them show you one where I'm from was it 2016 or, mm. tw or 20, tw 20, 20 something. And, it, and, and, and the time at the camera mm -hmm. was flickering between then and 2019 something. So uh, what, pretty much what, what he's saying, what was happening, the person was, was traveling in time. Walk through the wall, you know. Hmm? Pan camera. Hmm? Pan YouTube. Oh, okay, I'm going to type it in. Okay, man. Walk through the wall. And you see, and you see the camera, because you know camera have, have a time thing for the Cassidy. Um, video camera. And it has show you the time, a flicker, between the present time and the time where the person supposedly had time travel. Wow. 
in a 2019. Oh Lord, have mercy. Yeah, man. So this, this I, is getting I, spooky now. <laughs> I will pass something. You, you, you see, all one where one vehicle for move off at the stoplight, mm -hmm. and as if you move off, so one next vehicle drive in front of him, and you know, see where the vehicle appear from. Oh. See, so yeah, 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 it's a dash cam, you know. Mm -hmm. Right? You see one with a lady you now across one street. Like somebody a push. Was they pushing a pram or something? Mm -hmm. Remember, like across a, a the street. And as a vehicle for come, so for hit them. You see something, I figured us run, I figured us come, take them up out of the way. Oh my goodness. And just walk away. Oh wow. Caught on camera. And mm -hmm. you have to, actually, me, I wonder, yeah, you have to wonder if it's real. real. People, all of them something, you go up on YouTube, it did it. I've also seen videos where people get mowed over or something like that. Mm -hmm. Sorry. The vehicle actually like ran over them or something and you swear blind. Sorry, that them dead. Them dead. And they get up and walk away. It's like almost unscratched or something. Yeah. And people have gone through less and died. And dead. You know, it's, 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 I, I've seen one where that one I definitely, definitely don't believe where like something dropped from a girl under a car and she tried to get it and she just pushed her the car wow just pushed her the vehicle and, and, I like, and, I like, she, and I like she push it and it rolling up and it went she push it sideways I, I, I saw one where the man and the woman they were walking and it's like so they're going down the street and out of the blues I don't I don't Remember seeing a truck with a tire pass? Oh, uh, oh, and, and, and just come and, and the yeah, tire just yeah. came from across the road right, and just right, slapped right, the man right. to that, the ground, probably, yeah, man. probably killing him. They call that freak accident. Yeah. Freak accident, they call that. The, this next text, ladies and gentlemen, is a very is a, is a rather interesting, frightening sort of kind of text. Makes you stop and say, okay. But I'm now it gets re it doesn't get any realer than this. But I'm any salt. Oh, yeah, worse than you in the south. <laughs> Heart of love, my beloved brethren and sister. I big am up. a naturopathic, naturopathic, or naturopathic. Nature. Yeah? Naturopathic wellness and lifestyle counselor. Because of who I am, I will not mention my name, for I am associated with other radio stations. Okay? I never knew when I prayed for ones. They received what I prayed and asked for. My brethren, who does palm? And numerological. Numerology. Numerolo numerology. Yes, reading. reading yeah. That speak of your personality, mentality, and destiny. Patients who I see from day to day that I will say such and such about what is happening in their lives in terms of their sickness and also personal matters. So at times, I am called the reader man. I will say to someone, someone, God says, that all healers are visionary. They see who comes among them. It is a privilege to share. So when you are told anything to do of you by someone you don't, no, who don't and know you rather, and it is true, positive, positive thoughts, thoughts create positive results. It is all about your putting positive always to negative. Heart of love. Big up. Big ups to you too. Um, so this is somebody who says they actually have that, 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 that gift. ability and that gift yeah. to be able to Speak well, what is good? What, 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 what is good about what him say? Him say, boy, him never really know. Say when him I pray for them, them I receive the energy. You yeah, yeah, which yeah. is good. So, so that right there, so is a level of genuineness mm -hmm. in a way, man. Yeah, because he said he said didn't know. True. Mm -hmm. Wow. Um, I would want somebody like that to 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 to, to tell me what they think. Me can't tell you. No, not you. And we're in the next five years or the next ten years or the next less years than five years. You know, what will be happening? We can't we tell be? you. And, you know, it, for me, I don't think I'll be, well, I'll be scared if it's bad, bad news. But, but if it's not, then I would be intrigued. Five years from now, you're going to have house and land. Hey, go on, talk. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Time is so, what, a, what a way to break, people. What a way to break. When you come back, you hear more. It's now 11.30. The time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services. And Real Talk is sponsored by NASA, Native Audio Stage and Lighting. Afterwards, I tell you about the house, Alan. What you have to go do? Oh, Jesus. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 8 Eight nine three two two six six. Business operators, local and overseas. This announcement is for you. Styles FM is an internationally known radio network with worldwide listeners in over 120 countries. From our studio in Port Antonio, Jamaica, to the ears of the people in your community, our listeners can be your new customers. Styles FM is an economical, efficient, and effective advertising option for your business. No matter the size of your business, there's always growth potential. Styles FM provides the customer reach needed to realize that upward movement. So procrastinate no more. Advertising is a must. For more details on how to advertise with Styles FM, visit www.stylesfm.com or email info at stylesfm.com or call us on 876-518-2399. Styles FM, the world listens. You don't know this is Craig T now. We're representing for the Adrenaline Rush with a musical ingenious digital T. Saturday's right here on Styles FM. You don't know. 48 to make it a date and don't be late. You understand? Because the new arts is a new music segment. It's from 5 to 6. So make sure you're there and the girls there. I tell him I burn up the place. It's not left no space. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. Take us to work. Take us on the go. Take us wherever you go. Styles FM. Take Styles FM with you on the go. The number for you is 213-992-4360. That's 213-992-4360. And for the United Kingdom, 033-0010-3322. That's 033-0010-3322. Styles FM. Guess what? Styles FM has a new business number for you to call, text, and now WhatsApp. 518-2399. To advertise your business and events, call, text, or WhatsApp us on 518-2399. 518-2399. Don't forget, 518-2399. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Yep. Welcome back to Real Talk. We see the boy coming in, Javine. Let's see what Javine is saying. Good night to you too. Long time. Jay, what's up? All right. He has a comment. Daddy Rude, our old lady Cleo, I look so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You read up. You, you read it up. <laughs> um. Javin, read up, read what a man say. Good night to you, Javin. The people they want to hear what he <laughs> say. They don't want to hear what he say. Let me tell you about your house now. Oh, Jesus. Right? So in a five year time, you have house and land. <laughs> right? Yeah. I don't like my house, you know. But I, don't, I don't even know where he's going, people, but I don't even want to hear. He told them one nice size property. But you have one big tree. <laughs> one big tree, the panel. Manga tree? Me East no, Indian manga? I can't tell you the type of tree. <laughs> Right? Ah. But in the tree. Oh no. Yeah, duck ants. I go on big duck ants. Ah. <laughs> I tell you. I 
cantanimo. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> and if I cut the tree down and burn the duck ants, what, 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 what? I'll no. be fine. You can't touch the tree. Oh, Jesus. We have to figure out the duck ants, them. Oh, man. You can't touch the tree. I can't go and give you. The duck ants, them? Yes. Well, if, if you can't kill them. I can come give you. But even if you kill the one in that tree, remember the one in the underground. <laughs> so. Watch out for the duck and stuff oh, at your house. Oh boy, you're right? terrible. Thank you, the so, boy. You can't send me to read up things, you know. <laughs> you can't send me to oh, read up boy. things. Sir. So people who don't hear my powers. Who are the, who, who don't know. <laughs> or the curse. Or the curse. Let's see who our friends are on the Facebook Live and shout <coughs> them out right about now, no? Oh, we're not having any live at the moment. Yeah, there's another Vox Pop. All right, let's hear Another the, message. Yeah, another message. <laughs> okay. Marvin in Texas says, Fun and joke aside, Cleo. What if what daddy would say happen all next week? Look here now. <laughs> Marvin. Marvin. Because <laughs> no, you see? No, when I read the fun and joke aside, I was like, okay, somebody has something serious to say now that they yeah, want to share. Yeah. Only to see the last part of that no, sentence, but Marvin. Cleo, remember me saying, no, in a five years' time, I can next week, I'm still within five years. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I saw the power work. Me now want the duck and spot, Marvin. Take off the duck and spot. Do. <laughs> well, oh. another message is, 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 is there. Let's see what the other me message, messages are saying. Remember, people, the numbers are, the phone lines are open. Bel you can um, share. From, 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 yeah, that one, yeah. Um, four, three. That one I'm like. My beloved sister. Yeah. You're overly independent. Knew that. Could be very stubborn at times. You that. But you are not a selfish person. I know you that. Leave me alone, it's me that. <laughs> <laughs> You're growing to trust more. Heart of love. Oh my God. No me afraid. <laughs> Is it your first time listening to this program? Mm -hmm. Uh oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Nobody never read me up so yet. You don't want me to read you. No, me don't want you to read me. Keep alone read me. <laughs> <laughs> Bobby goes with duck hands in a tree. No, sir. But this Look person... Here. No, no hold on. Is it Cassidy. your first time? Cassidy. This is serious now, man. Well, this is serious. You want me serious? So, Cassidy, you didn't hear me say I'm get big house. Me don't even tired again. Me don't even tired. Me say I have house and land. Me say the land is big. Me say the house is big. <laughs> <laughs> that small duck and toes. <laughs> no, and I see, no, this <laughs> Marvin said, Marvin, anyone is will work for me because I can sand dash it and yes, um, part it off and so on with drywall and all these things. I look pretty same way, like the front house, them, yes. Mm -hmm. Um, for a joke aside, for true Marvin, I know this Marvin. Gent I know I'm just saying using the same words that Marvin used. Okay, this gentleman, I see. As we were saying in our colloquial term, they must be true. Oops. Yeah, man, they must be true because this sister is independent for true, probably overly so. Stubborn for true. Mm -hmm. At times for true, it's at times, all the time. But strong will for true, yeah, strong will and stubborn. And I'm so honestly not selfish for true. My friends will tell you, my real genuine, which is not many, a few. They'll, the few genuine ones I know yeah. will tell you I'm not a selfish person at all. I, I don't know how to be selfish. Um, you're going to trust more. I am trying. Yes, it's true. More and the thing, heart yeah. is full of love for true. Nothing but love in this art and laughter. So I really want to know if it's the first time he's listening because if it is the first time he's listening, he must see. Will he pass something for true, true? Because he wouldn't have picked up on my stubborn and those things for true 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 so, yeah. okay so, cool. so 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 hold on a little bit now oh you? my goodness oh my god i'm oh wow i'm wowed so what so hold on me with this like oh salad you know what by me yes i'm gonna have small house in never bowl or concrete <laughs> and it's gonna be have, we have duck hands that eat under the bottom me don't want to eat that for you <laughs> I give him one cock and I'm shining. <laughs> Thank 
you, the boy. Thank you so much, my dear. I stopped calling thick. Boy. <laughs> That could mean one thing, the boy says. Daddy Rude, she found him. Mm. It's kids night Friday, so kids and daddy time. Okay, not a problem, the boy. Do your thing, brother. I love it. Oh, my. My friend is typing. The one who just read me. He's typing. And what Kevin's saying there. Kevin, let me see what Kevin is saying. We're going to go back to our other friend in, in a minute. Kevin says, I get a dream. Okay, we got that one earlier. What is this Kevin saying? Everyone have spiritual guardian angel. Keep your eyes open and you will see things. My eyes are always open, Kevin. I'm not seeing anything. Except the messages on the screen. And Daddy Rose shine in. <laughs> um let's 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 go back to our other friend there who was reading me up because this is fascinating, you know. Um yes. Read up Rose to do. Um mm -hmm. no, below that, um Cassidy. Um I, I want to know what 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 you what you're feeling the energy you're feeling from rude cuz him have good heart to you know Ooh. No 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 correction you am I don't want to hear about rude because rude is just no good Daddy rude is no good but you <laughs> is a good youth Oh All right so uh, we we, we want to see persons who are who wish to call in or text in the lines are open um, 876-453-1444 um, Overseas 954-338-7973 Again, our friends on Overseas hey. are pretty much just yes. Yes. didn't get all the show, but of course you can always I don't even want to read it. Too much porn has a friend that's never come up. You know what they're sitting there when I turn the right way there. We need even judgment there. So we can't talk the way out of that out right now. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. So it, it, it's, it's a fascinating oh. topic today. Well, well, um, it's, it's fascinating. So we're not going to the, the letter? No, we are waiting for next week because the gentleman is still yeah. um, typing and I want to know what he has to say about you. Kevin mm. says, Lady Cleo, you're a good woman. You are not selling any fish. You're right about that. I love to eat fish, though. <laughs> 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 Parrots, to be specific. <laughs> I'm not supposed to, but I like the parrot ones. I'm so sorry. We're not supposed to. It is said that they're the scavengers and they, they clean the sea and all these things. Then um, they after them clean the sea, we clean them. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. They taste the best to me. Um... So who, so who come up with all of that stuff for the boy because fish niam niam this and niam that. Thank you, Kevin. So onto doggo. Eat doggo? Who? Mm? Doggo. No, me not eat him. <laughs> not him. He sounds like a male. Clear. <laughs> <laughs> uh, nobody, he sounds like a man. Hold on. Nobody know I never what, hear no fish named doggo. I'm sorry. I never heard that. Yes, you don't know doggo. Yeah. You don't must know People who don't know Dogo. And you're a young bird. You don't know Storm. I can't I've believe this. I've never heard a fish named Dogo before. Dogo sound like a man. <laughs> I ain't eating that. Oh, that's stay. Yo, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> no reading can't help you. <laughs> I, I honestly, I've never oh. heard a fish named Dogo. <laughs> I hear, hold on, let me tell you what I hear of. I, I hear of parrots. <laughs> Yeah. I hear of Jack. Yeah. I hear of Snapper. Yeah. I hear of um, Sprat. Sprat. Yeah. I used to eat Sprat a lot when mommy used to cook Sprat back in yeah. the days. She still does. I, I, I hear of um, Barracuda. Yeah. I hear of... Goat mullet. Mullet. I hear of one next sawfish. No. Easy for... We're talking about goat mullet. Because you have different mullets you now. Well, me about mullet overall. You have mullet. There's another one that's soft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Butterfish. Have, yeah, butterfish. That one yeah. I mean. Yes. You have mullet, you know. Where when time dry, you know, see them, you see if I rain or fall, you see them, they must say, hand your house. See, I want a wedding. There. I hear of group, 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 groupie? Groupie. Groupie. Or they grouper. Up, right? I heard of that. Well, even though you must know I dog heard of um, starfish. A starfish? My girl, star, starfish. Goldfish? You can't hear goldfish. I know, I'm going to tell me here about. But they look pretty though. Like yeah, they're pretty yeah, fish too, yeah, bad, yeah, bad, yeah, bad. Yeah. So I've heard of all them fish. And, and shark. And that dog. And whale. And. But no dog. Oh, it's having nice sea. Big do fish. Dog on the nice sea. What big fish name? The big fish them. Shark. Whale. Whale. Squid. 
Squid. Janga. A fish that? Well, um, crawfish. One next something when name when name is um C Dudu. C Dudu. Something like so. Oh, it's, oh it's clear talk about. But I've heard of so many other things. Shrimp. Busu. Those are fish? If you know. I've never heard of no dugo. Dugo when you when you dugo. <laughs> 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 no dugo around here. No. Okay. no. The voice no. says, Lady C, dugo a river fish. Lord, oh Lord. You, you are no fish, lady man. No, I'm like, only part one fish, me like a parrot. I really know the others, well, them I'm, really. A few, me, me know, um, the butterfish, because it look different. Dugo a big groupie. The one next big flat one. What that name? Flat fish? Flat. In silver, shiny. Jack? Another one there, down the long, down the broad and and and, and See, flat. Me know where I talk, but me know where name. And it glistens. Me know where me know glistens. where I talk. I don't like it. Yeah, but next one where when it when it when it f make tea, fish tea. Yeah. And the skin just roll over so like it. Doctor tough. fish. Doctor, I know that I one too. Turbit. See turbit, I'll hear about that one too. But I don't know what them all of them look like. But I never hear of no dugo. Dugo. Mm -hmm. Doggo. Do good, do good, doggo, <laughs> dege is the same thing. I've never heard of that fish. I'm sorry. Okay? Yo. So let, let's see what our friend is saying about is it about you or about me? Doggo in the drain. You know, you, 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 you know the drain? No wonder why I'm not going to eat doggo. Mm? No, no, I'm not going to eat doggo because it's not a drain. Uh, the big do, say dog, dogo, say dogo, dogo. Dogo, dogo. I don't want a dogo, dogo fish. <laughs> My friend on my friend there. No, no. Okay, Cassie, you're Let's, hear. Let's hear what he says. Heart of love, beloved. Yes, it is. I run into styles. Oh, it's the first time listening. Oh my god. I run into styles FM by scanning and heard some of real, real, some real, real reggae. Oh that thought. Good night, scholar. Welcome back. Okay, I just listened to clear and I must drop off the bed. So clear, I never know say so you can eat the good dog nowadays. <laughs> no, I don't eat the good I I told you I would not eat a, I've never had a dugu fish and I don't want to eat a dugu fish either. It's like a meal. But yeah, as, as when I was when I was growing up in Jamaica, when I was there about dugu fish, you know what I mean? As soon as we leave school we used to go and look at uh, is it Dugo or Dugo? Catch down the fish, the little fish. It's Dugo, it's called Dugo fish. What is it? Dugo or Dugo? Dugo. I don't want no Dugo fish to eat. I don't know which, I don't know which, what Dugo Dugo you want to eat. No, Dugo, Dugo no sound right. Like, I don't want to eat that, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but yeah, man, I, 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 when you, when you mm -hmm. used to go catch dog or fish and um, group him and stuff. I you them. used to eat it? No, we not used to catch them. Can they be eaten? That part I'm not sure, but you know, so we used to catch them, especially the small little group of them. Yeah. So I used to go, I used to go drip at school, and there's like a little tank thing that house all the group in them, and we used to catch them. Uh huh. But we don't, we never eat them. We don't used to catch them for fun. Okay. But if you want to catch your dugu dugu fish and eat them, more part of you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. All right. All, All right. right. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay. <Not all. laughs> you know you're the worst, right? Uh, no, I'm not. I mean, you're actually trying trying to be. Pr you see, Cassidy. You see, Mr. Earl, I said trouble set like rain. You see the proper thing about Cleo? That, uh, that reach her. Me said doggo fish, and she can't say doggo. She can only say the other word that I can't repeat. Right? <laughs> it is beyond me to say such thing, such, in my opinion, profane sounding thing. Okay. Right? No, I, I got the pronunciation wrong. Dugo, doggo. It's the same thing, really. It's just that it doesn't sound right to me. Doggo? Doggo fish. Or doggo fish or doggo. Yeah, it be, it, it, it be group of them. I, I, so I think I the doggo right fish, now. I think the doggo fish, them doggo. I don't like them. I, I don't know. I don't like them. No. No, no doggo, doggo, nothing. Have you ever eaten doggo, doggo, doggo fish? <laughs> Have you ever eaten them, Cassidy? No, please don't. It doesn't sound. Have you ever had them? No, you're not going to have doggo. 
So you think about dog fish for dinner every day you talk about dog or dugo? I, I thought it could be eaten. Well, I'm not saying it can't be, but I said, well, that's true. Me just say, you, you know, near me. But no, people, I've people, never... people might eat it. Remember, people eat snail. Huh? Yes. Which one is snail? The snail, the big old snail. I don't know nobody eating no snail. Stop it, man. Of course. Like coal. When you have asthma, they say you have a snail. And you have a name ratties. Can we go back to You drink ratties tea and ganja. Can we go back to Dogo? Dogo? <laughs> you prefer when you have a Dogo? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you don't have Dogo than the snail? Uh, yes! <laughs> And they call them on a different name too. So if you have a slug? choice, slug. Right? So if you have a choice, swamp so pat a doggo, yeah? I'll pat a snail. I go doggo. You're gonna have doggo. Finally. If those were the <laughs> options. Or better yet, I'll just eat some, some bush. Oh. Some green bush. Hey, Kias, you see the, the picture with a big old bullfrog, big light man? What's that? You don't see it? I saw it. What is that? This is Saint Mary. But in a company news or nothing. What are you make news? A big old bullfrog suck. That's an everlasting bullfrog. I would see that thing and flip over, literally. Right. Because I'm, so, I'm afraid of the small ones much less. So I want to know anybody from St. Mary can tell me if I choose something. And I want to know if they kill it. What do they not kill it? What they must do with it? Tame it? No, yeah, you, you know, have to go, go look at it and see if you can make a couple of picnic and see them and get some big frog and we start farm them and, and send them off go, 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 make a, go make a big money and fight. What's wrong with you? I mean, he and salt. But if you think about the money, just the investment. Throw, you just throw him on the bullfrog. Yeah? Yes. You can imagine one spring chicken, one of him foot, about 30 spring chicken that. You know, kill that. Oh, you have to think investment. Money. Jesus. Now let's. Uh, thank you. Then someone have asthma, <clears throat> Cass, uh, Cass, you have to pick up a bullfrog about it. Can you imagine oh, how, 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 how people would have cured? Now let's say. Everybody. Cleo, one my big son line. In out. law. Oh. Mute. Please mute this mic. <laughs> Cleo, my son in law, eats, sna eats snails. He's from Ghana. Yeah. <clears throat> Kevin says, Miss Cleo, don't make them set you up by eat. Set you up. By eat some grappy. Grappy or groupy? Eat some. <laughs> some crappy this. Crappy this. Win some. Do good. Do, doggy, doggy. Doggy, doggy. <laughs> His first time, look up Pitney used to do. Mama, <laughs> <laughs> win some, please. Do good, do good. Right. Um, Davine said, snail soup good for asthma. Yeah. Me hear it nice, Lord Jesus. Yes. Me no want to know if yet. it nice still. You never eat bussy yet? Some good. You don't drink bussy soup yet? I'm they not know, fond of it. They no cousin them? Jesus. They my cousin. Cousin and cousin boy good soap. Oh, God. I see him thing. Oh, God. Snail. What is Marvin saying? Because my head just start. My head grew right now. Are you, you know? Yeah, I grew. Yes, are you? <laughs> Hold on, let me see if I find a bill. Oh no, my no, goodness. no, me, me they delete the bullfrog. Oh Anybody from St. Mary can tell me if something really goes so. Roxanne, more I know if something goes so with the big old frog when I see them and say, St. Mary come from. I've never heard of that fish before, Marvin. Never heard of that fish before. Um, my mind is right here. Your mind is telling <laughs> you no? <laughs> Um, Sean, you can't call me. Marvin, I'm, I'm in the point here, Sean, man. Marvin says that my mind, where my mind gone with Dugu Dugu. I just thought it was a, I just use the word interchangeably. I thought it was the same thing, pretty much. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so we, we go back. Sean, you're I'm Dugu. Yeah, come call me. My friend who was listening for the very first time, thank you very much for the assessment. Yes, um, thank you so much. Um, interesting. I trust you will listen again from now on. And as you see the, <clears throat> the, 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 the appearances before you, you can share. Yeah, man, big up the man with a gift. Yes. You know what I mean? Because the show tonight is about people like you. You, right. Right, we're and out there and we can you know, so make people see things beyond. You know, you, you have foresight. Their normal eyes. Can see. You see me, all who have the foresight 
and them have the thing and them use it for the right reason. Yes, right. Because, right, right, because, right. because you have some people out oh, there, all them can't say, boy, um, the one over there so careful like the one there and mm -hmm. up, and, and up put on that shoes if you sitting sitting white in your shoes. Right? No powder in your shoes. Then take back in the days of Cassidy, when you have cheesy foot, you know, I powder them a thing in a boat. <laughs> so you see a man take off in boat and you see between into a white, you say, Lord have mercy, you go put on a boat. Right? Mm. So, you know, big up all of the people who have the vision and have the the the, the, the powers then. Yeah. The gift. The gift of being right. able to see and hear and know things yeah. before they happen while they're happening. Before, True. You know, yep. A member, bread of salt. <laughs> right? <laughs> Only to be thrown on that big bullfrog. Yeah. Yeah. Gracie says, Escargot. Escargot. You ever realize what the bullfrog them? The woman want big so, and the man are little so. The women are not big. We are small too. No. Yes. The woman want not big so, and the man are little so. And, little, so. and I even manage that, you know? Yo. <laughs> <laughs> a power to you from them, man. Let's see what the boy is saying here, man. Um, <clears throat> do go, do go. No, 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 no. Um, yeah, cousin and cousin boy have good soup, <laughs> but I ain't into drinking none. Cass River settings next month. All right, so. Hey, listen. <laughs> the boy is terrible, you know. Oh, let's see who else has a message on the text line here. Yes, rude. Lady Grace is texting yeah. us. But we have a little bit of time left. People, may I tell you from now, Fan Fusion at the party where we turn up to, and we know the settings they saw already, right? Peaceful setting, nice energy. Yeah. Everybody, Adults only. I want them party where you can step on somebody too, and you say, boy, step on it again. <laughs> right? Nice party. Yeah. And nice we, energy. And nice aura. energy. Yeah. Right. So, you know, prepare yourself and do me a big one. Get in a tropical outfit now, please. When Cassidy comes up, bam, and take the picture. Me no want to say no Sunday best. Right? More as a tropical outfit. At six years now, we had to do that party here. And we a tropical theme. Straight, non-stop. Right? Film tropical sitting. Tropically elegant. Film tropical sitting. Cassidy, somebody cuts me off last year. So every year, me I wear long sleeves. So, you know, a short sleeve me I wear this year. Right? <laughs> short sleeve me I wear this year. Right? I'm freezing me I wear one white pants. Hey? Yeah, one white pants me I wear. Rich kid. No. I want, hey, look, you're look so. No, you were really like, no. Me, me did buy if you go on all white show. Mm -hmm. And the show not go on. So, me wear the pants I come now buy no more pants. All right. Right? I'm yet to figure my outfit. I don't know yet. But something nice, I hope, I'll find with my mask. Yeah, man. I need me and my mask. And the and cheap people. All of the women, they want to know, say, they have money to spend for them. But the man go on Amazon and type Which in. Which is right. Type in mask. I want to get a little mask. The, right? the boy has his shirt already for this fan fusion. No, 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 come in on a Freddy mask or Jason mask <laughs> or um, mask mask. scream mask. No, oh, but oh. I let them in. Oh. Remember, you know. We don't want nobody to say them a hide them face in terms of whatever. Zane. They're not afraid, they're not scary, nothing. Right. We don't depend on that. DG, nah, let Uno's in. And if we don't enter in and we see Uno, Uno's have to exit. Well, Uno's we'll take off a mask. Right? <laughs> so. Hi, <laughs> Joy. Thanks for being locked in, Joy. Thank you, girlfriend. So, we're we telling you from now. Send them as people. Well. Right? Uno know from now. Let me tell you what to do for make money after Daddy Rose sitting. Just come and get with some mask and sell it one one for hundred dollar. <laughs> some cheap Chinese mask. You see how some of the people in a Christmas time when on a mask don't sell off, we normally get the pity them. Right? Just come and get and sell it one one. Uno can't enter with it. Right? But uno sell it out there. I tell you make a money here. Right? Real I'm a one ten percent. Ten percent fee salt, man. Right? So all of the people who have them clothing. Place where I sell clothes, stuck out on a tropical outfit, stuck out on a mask for this year. Right? Because that'll be one of the themes. I try to get back some of the something we we'll do last year, and I can't get them, and I just feel so my energy at them and say, boy, I'm going to get scammed. So I don't think I'm going to bother with it this year. Seriously. The, um, the Sky Lantern sitting. Why not? 
I can't find a supplier. Oh my. And one one tell me if you do something, and I don't want to do it, I tell me if you do something. Mm. So I tell me, boy, I'm not bothered with it. Right, so I don't know about it, it is still. I want to know so well, I have, have something special for the people. Definitely. Right. That's the. Yep. The v, I, I laughed at some persons with that last year. It was really funny for me. Really, really fun. Exciting to see them trying to get it up. And some persons were actually lighting them. And it was just kind of funny. And they were laughing too. So it was a good look. <laughs> the voice says, I'll be selling mask, people. Forget for telling them. Yeah. All right, the boy. <laughs> the boy have, have mask selling. And Kevin so, thinks you're mentally ill, which I, which I endorse. Yeah. Okay. Just to say. <laughs> Lady Grace, Daddy Rude. Check your WhatsApp. Okay. All righty. All right. So, ladies and germs, the time is now midnight. Night. Right? Bong, 12 bong, a. Bong. M. It is now Saturday morning. Officially, happy birthday to who have a birthday today. And my first, whoever would have normally won first. The, whoever. Whoever. Um, well, for me, I got to run on home before I become a pumpkin again. <laughs> I'm not gonna come uh, in. 